Hello friends, uh, welcome again and this is my new project online nursery store and I have developed this project in Node.js and Angular and the database I am using is the MySQL. Node.js version I am using Node version 14, Angular version is 13 and MySQL version is 5.6. I have used Visual Studio code for writing all of the codes of Node.js as well as the Angular. Right, so we have developed all of the APIs on the angle uh, on the Node.js side, and Angular is consuming all of those APIs for getting data from MySQL database. Right, uh, so this is the way application. So for front end development, we have used HTML CSS also. So you can see this is a bootstrap theme, and we have used HTML CSS for designing this theme. Right, so let's start with the functionality. Go through. Uh, what are the features what are the modules available in this project online nursery store right so once you run this so one thing is a port so we are running uh, the node application on port 3000 and angular application on port 4200 both are the default default port of the application right so once you run this project you will get this home page you can see this is the home page right so these are the some of the categories coming on the home page and these are the dynamic categories which are coming through the api from the mysql database right if you click on the category then you will be able to find the records of that category products of that category right so this is the home page this content is static this is a about a page and this is also a static content if you want to change it then you can change from the about uh, angular component right this is a categories all of the categories which is available in the database will be displayed here you can see there are six categories available in the database so it's displaying here if you click on the category you will be able to see the products of that category you can see these are the products of that category right and these are the uh, costing right if you click on the details you will be able to see the details of that category right so this is the login and this is a customer login one more thing i want to explain you this is a mini project it has only and only customer login there is no admin login available in in this project but if you need the admin login we will develop it also so this is a login if you don't have login then you can register from here this is a registration from from here you can register and you can create your login and details right this is a contact us page this is a static contact us page we are not saving the details of this contact us page anywhere even we are not sending details of uh, contact us through email and sms we are not sending it this is a feedback form and this is a, a static feedback form even we are not saving this form too right now i am going to log in right so the user id is amit at gmail.com and the password is test once you log inside the system you will get this dashboard so this is the dashboard you can see oh i already explained to you about us this is the order now means for shopping right this is my orders means all of the orders which you have placed earlier will be displayed here if you click on any of the order you will be able to see all of the details so you can see order id is this and order uh, name is customer contact each and everything is here and these are the items which you have purchased right so this is the my order section now i am going to buy some of the plants online right so this is the categories right and i want to details and add into the cart so you can see this item i have added into the cart right now i am going to continue adding and this is the grains and this is the details add to cart so i have added two items into the cart continue adding and this is the frozen seeds this one details and add into the cart i have added three items into the cart and total amount i need to pay is 300 rupees right 300 suppose it's 500 deleted just click on the hit delete button and it will be deleted from your cart <coughs> right now i want to check out means i want to confirm the order just click on the checkout this is a dummy payment gateway page where uh, you need to enter the card details so no need of entering correct credit card details just enter the card what you want to so any dummy data you can add here right once you click on the make payment your order id will be generated you can see order id is 11 and your order id has been generated now if you want to see the order in history just go on the my order section and this is the order id 11 and on this date and time you have ordered and this order amount is 200 once you click on this arrow icon you will be able to see all of the order details right the last thing is the logout logout so this is the session driven menu if you click on the logout then the session will be destroyed and you will not be able to see the my administration section because it's rendering according to the session 
so you can see it's not coming because session has been destroyed but if you log in the sessions are coming so this internal page will work for differently for different customers right means if you click on my orders then your orders will be displayed and if another customer click on the my orders their order will be displayed right so these all functionalities uh, we have developed inside this project online nursery store as i told you earlier this is a mini project which has only customer functionality we have developed in node.js version 13 and angular version uh, node version 14 and angular version is 13 and mysql version is 5.6 but if you need any enhancement any new things inside this project just put it into the comments we will incorporate those changes we will make this project more better and better according to our requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos on the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much